barbarian with a ring. Probably not going to find good rings. Usually by this point I have two uh, yellow rings, but those have not been dropping for me in this playthrough, unfortunately. Uh, but, you know, I still have some damn good equipment, so I can't complain too much just because one, one or two run-throughs gives me better items of this, but this one has given me better items of something else. These, uh, these scepters are damn good. Damn good. And I don't, there isn't a socketed scepter that I can, uh, use a rune word on, as far as I know. Nothing good. Nothing good for my character, I should say. I'm sure there is one. I just, uh, have my notes here written in front of me, and I, I, I don't have anything for, uh, for my character for a scepter, because it, it just doesn't work. It doesn't work. Ooh. Instead, they want me to go for a flail because of the rumor, and they're like, it doesn't matter if it doesn't give you plus to your paladin skills. And I'm like, yes, it does, damn it. Okay. So I'm going to need to pick this up and put that in there. What are you on? You are on what I need you to be on. Uh, so who cares about the trident anymore? It is not going to be worth it. Don't even need to pick it up. Because you're already on the M tier. And M tier is damn good. Damn good. I mean, it's not the best thing for him, but it's definitely the best thing that I can get for him right now. The other thing, like... For him, uh, yeah, four sockets and a rune that I don't have yet. We are still get we are getting up there in rooms, though. Oh, um, yeah, I forgot about this part. Yeah, th these places are huge. Act 5, it's expansive s expansion set because the landscape is expansive. I mean, in terms of how many areas there are, it might actually be less than the other acts. Well, at least one through three. But in terms of how long it takes to go through them, yes, this is the longest act by a mile. And that makes up for Act 4 being so short, I think, is what they were trying to go for. Sometimes I try to get into the mind of programmers, and I should know better, because th that is a sleep-deprived mind most of the time. But I'm starting to get a little sleep-deprived, so maybe I'm on to something. Why is there a barricaded door with nothing inside? Why? That's all I ask. Why? And apparently something popped up. I don't know if you guys saw that. Hopefully you didn't. But apparently my printer has an update that it wants me to install. No, printer, go away. Nobody likes you. You're our printer. Uh, I, have, I have yet to find a good printer, to be honest with you. <laughs> I keep looking. Uh, I keep buying new ones, and we keep going through them. But I have yet to have one that lasts con that, that's good after like five years or so. And that's why they make them so cheap, I guess, because they expect you to go through them. And you don't feel too bad. Well, yeah, I had to buy a new printer, but it's only about $100, and it lasts me about five years. But it shouldn't break that soon. Like, that's not really the point, is it? Yes, it is. Just because it's cheap doesn't mean that it can be awful. Uh, so let's head back up here. Keep going through the barricade door. Because we have a little more to go through. This place is huge. I think this is the largest area we've gone through yet. How how much further does it go? God, this place is starting to get ridiculously big. I understand that you're trying to be a plateau. That doesn't mean you have to go on forever. Because it's the frozen wasteland, right now I just want to call this place Alaska. Because it just goes on and on, it never ends, and you can get lost so easily. See, look, we're still not done. There's another way up, so we have to go th down here a little bit. Zigzag across. What the hell? Okay, that was a little bit of a delay, but now, you know, the pop-up that printer gave me exited me out of the game for a second there, so... That sucks. Hopefully you guys didn't see that too much. <laughs> but I tried to stop recording in the middle there. So we can keep going. Uh, yes, when you have all tab, the game goes on without you, as you might have seen there. Um, and 
that's why well whatever whenever you wanna that's why you can't really save because well the game goes on when you're not here into the pit of Acheron Acheron I don't know I don't recognize the name see that's a skull pile this is background how that makes sense I, I don't fully understand but I can kind of tell the difference Damn it, they're all skulls. Why can't why why do some skulls have gold in them and others do not? I do not understand. Alright, let's keep going through here. And damn it, I will get through the Ariat Bateau. This thing is is going on a lot longer than I was expecting. And we have upgraded lashers here. We have overlords. And uh, they didn't really drop anything good. I'm disappointed. But those, uh, are those upgrade? I think that, were they moon lords before? <laughs> I don't remember anymore. So these are night lords. Uh, I think they were night lords before. The upgrade is moon lord, I think. Either way, we'll, we'll surely come across those. But you usually can find some good equipment in here. I'm very disappointed with the last one, actually. And we have icy boars as well. But you are going to be fighting a lot of ice enemies around here, so... Hopefully you guys uh, have a great cold resistance. I think mine's decent. No, it's awful. 37 is not good for a paladin at this point. Because technically, I'm a tank. You know, I'll have zero my tank for me a little bit here and there, but I'm supposed to be able to take the damage with all my health. And so I need resistances. Because they damage me with those. If I don't have high resistance. And look! Look how much damage they're doing to me. When they get surround when they get a surround on you. Still not nearly as bad as it was uh, with the Venom Lords when they got a surround on me, but still the uh, the night was pretty pretty tough. I don't want to heal because I have prayer. Alright. I'll use a greater heal, why not? It's not like I'm using those any other time. More icy boars, though. More icy boars. So, yes, uh, we have to keep going through Alaska. A huge, expansive place with damn near nothing in it. It's definitely tundra around here. Uh, but we will definitely get to uh, the crystalline... Um, passage, I think it was. Crystalline passage? I've already forgotten. They have, like, yeah, sometimes it's, it's hard for me to remember w what one name translated to the other. Crystalline Passage, Crystalline Trail? I think it was the Glacial Trail. The Crystalline Passage. Alright, now I'm full on inventory now, I believe. I don't see anything over there. Not worth going back there for. Uh, there's a lot of dead ends in these places, unfortunately, especially with those giant wagons cutting off. The way that should be circular. Go, blessed hammer! Why did that not kill everything in sight? Uh, probably gonna need to level up blessed hammer some more because it's not doing as much damage as it should. Die. Okay, how much does blessed hammer do? Tree. T for tree. That makes sense. Uh, 99 to 108. Uh, seven, two, so nine, nine times fourteen, more than a hundred percent. So we're talking two hundred damage as opposed to the fifty that I'm doing. Okay, two hundred damage. That's not as bad as I was picturing, but it doesn't seem to be killing enemies in one shot anymore, damn it. Okay, I killed him, so apparently I just missed before. It did half him. Fine. So apparently I really did just suck with it before. Get over here and die. Yeah, I'm just not hitting them with it. Superior War Scepter. I want it. I want to take a look at it. Going back to town then. Fine, you forced my hand yet again, game. Now this place is going a lot longer than I thought it would. There he is. Damn, I, I need to, to put my you. inventory screen away when I'm trying to find Deckard Kane because he's hard to spot over there. At your service. Right, of course. Repair my stuff too. Uh, replenish life. No. 
and the key can go as well. Damn it, why am I so low on room? Alright, that did not sound good. Right. No, no, yes, thank you. Damn, that's all good. Glad I picked that up. Are you kidding me? God, it was blue too. There was no way of me finding that out without actually picking it up. Good lord. Uh, yes. Sweet. Regular amethyst levels up. Oh, whoa, whoa. I just spotted the topazes. Nice. I don't know if you guys caught that already. So let's, uh, we'll get to the topaz in a second. But it does look like I'm going to be able to get a perfect, which is awesome. My first perfect. I was expecting more by now, to be honest with you. But I'll take one. One is good. It's not as good as six, but one's, one's good. Perfect! It kind of forms like a teardrop shape for all of them. So here's the best that you can get. 24% chance of getting magic items. That's what I would use it for. So put it on armor and helms. Uh, shields, lightning resist plus 40 is also nice. Weapons, I would not use it for weapons. No. Why would, why would you want 1 to 40 lightning damage? That does not seem like a smart maneuver at all. Uh, you guys can go over there. You can go over there. And one of you can go back in. And now we're good. Now we're good. Probably sell off some of those potions. I need to stop picking those up. And as you can see, I'm still broke. <laughs> um, so I need to go over to you to heal. No, that, but that's all I need to do. I don't want to look at your stuff anymore. Superior War Scepter. Ethereal. Didn't have any bonus to Paladin skills. Anyway. Damn it, that lord died. How did I not kill him? They cast, like, some kind of poison? Whatever. Uh, Rondash. Let's take a look at the Rondash. That was the last time we saw one of those. And Demon Hide Boots. Okay, that's ethereal, so that's crap. Demon Hide Boots are upgraded. Leather boots, as you put it. Oh. I think they're just boots, actually. Demon hide boots are upgraded boots. Uh, you get 31 defense, and that's pretty much it. So, I mean, that's better than what we had, but I would rather keep half freeze duration, especially considering where we are, which is Alaska. God. Just frozen wasteland. Give me that chest. A circlet. Have we seen a circlet? We might not have seen one. I swore we have, though, but they're kind of nice. They usually have some good s some good magic upgrades on them, but nothing to, to write home about most of the time. Um, nothing that I'm going to automatically go, Oh my god, I can't believe I found one. Yeah, no. So we are done in the pit of Asheron. Uh, I think that's how you're supposed to say it. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. It's been a while. It's been a while. Um... It's Greek, though. I remember that. So, I believe it'd, it'd be a hard C, like Acheron. I don't know. My Greek is horrible. It's been a... Uh, I don't know. I never took any spelling bees or anything like that. But root words. I did look at them once. Uh, Acheron, I believe, is... Um, like, one of the something to do with Hades. I remember hang him hanging out down there for whatever reason. I want to say it, it was like either a river or... It wasn't the guy. The guy's name was Sharon or something like that. Charon. I don't know. The boatsman. You have to pay his toll. Ow. I don't know if these stack or not. I'd rather have the the armor shrine. I thought they did, but I was told they didn't stack the shrine, so... I, I don't want to risk it right now because I need the, the defense more than I need the poison. Alright, we can take these guys on, but once again, this place is going on a lot longer than I had thought it was. I thought it was going to. I probably should have ended the session before I went through here, but the show must go on. Because I'm starting to get pretty tired, actually. Uh, you know, I can tell the difference when 
I'm starting to get tired on the commentary, so I will try to keep it as upbeat as I can while we're still going. Uh, Topaz. Uh, well, thank you, but I, I've already got the Topaz up as high as I want it to go. Could always use multiple to like, you know, multiple like, perfects, I guess. Ah, God, no, we're just moving on. No. We'll deal with you some other time. I'm not a big fan of yours, ever. Not right now, not ever. I hate you. Oh my god. You see that why I hate these guys? They're so hard to hit. And they know it. And they, therefore they run all the time. And when they're moving and you're trying to hit them with melee stuff, it becomes ridiculous. Just ridiculous. Okay. Let's break down all the buildings because I don't want anybody jumping on those. And the slayers! Down they go. Don't need to pick that up anymore. Horned helm up there. Take a look at that. Get up there. God, just go, blessed hammer. Kill, maim, destroy, wound. Whatever you do, do it! <laughs> because it's not fun taking these guys on so often. We just run all over this fucking place. Okay. Get myself more gold. Damn it! Die! Everything must die. Okay. Uh, nothing here. Nothing to destroy over here. Because you never know when those rascals are going to show up and land on one of the towers and start messing your day up. Luckily I do have more fire resist, so it shouldn't be nearly as bad. Uh, come on, tell me we're near the end here. Is that the end? No, that is not the end. You've got to be kidding me. Just everything die, please. I'm starting to get annoyed once again. Not even by the demons. Just by how big this damn plateau is. This is definitely the biggest area we've ever come across in this game. And I think it is the biggest area in the game. But good lord, there's no excuse for it this being this big. I'm trying to be intimidating with, with how slowly I have to go through this. Uh, we might have succeeded. Possibly. Okay. Oh, there was a horned helm over there that I missed. I don't care! It probably wasn't going to be that great anyway. It, it probably was a theory. That's my story. I'm just going to do it. Uh, I reject your reality and so Oh, there it is. Might as well pick it up. Yes, I reject your reality and substitute my own. Which is... I'm savage and also... It is ethereal! The hell? I'm savage and some crappy movie I found out. But you can buy that on a shirt. If you want to cough up like $40 for a shirt. That was ridiculous when I saw that. I'm like, oh yeah, Mythbusters! Oh, how much are you charging? No! I don't want one that badly. Yeah, hurry up and kill him. Okay. Further up this way. God, this thing just goes on forever. I feel like we've somehow gone through the area plateau. or We're at Mario's infinite staircase or something. It just keeps going and going and going. Fine, we'll take you on. You spotted me. And they do cast, you know, like poison bolts. Demon head. One to Blood Golem. Blood Golem is actually very good. So I will look at that. Didn't really. I don't remember there ever being houses here. But apparently there are. Dull Rune. Holy crap! Is that good? Yeah, I'm not even a high enough level to use that yet. I'm at uh, level 30, I think. So I, I need to get to the next level. Hit causes monster to flee. To flee, replenish life. That that is a damn good find right now. Damn good. Which kind of tells me that I'm under level because I'm finding rooms that I'm not even high enough level to you yet. That's not a good sign. Ooh, superior spirit masks. Spirit masks are upgraded uh, druid items, so that's good as well. Let's keep going now. Need to head up here. 
and find nothing. Fine. Come on, tell me. There we go. We're finally at the end of the area plateau. It took a long time, though. It took a long time. And let's defeat these guys. These guys are all hanging out at the entrance to the next area, I believe. Uh, well, like right next to it. Damn you, baby. Stop popping on me. Dark. Uh, no. No, they're not next. To there they go. These are the guys here. Let's see. Okay. Oh, we got a special crush beast. That's not fun at all. Can't carry, any Can't carry any of that. Fine. Back to town. No, not back to town. Keep on forgetting that I have room in there for whatever reason. Here we go. And we can continue on. Oh, and we've come across our first evil urn. Let me clear out the area all around it first. And we'll come back to that and I'll explain why I'm doing this in just a second. Well, why? When we get to it. Evil urns are different than everything else. And I do like evil urns, so though. <laughs> I'm a fan of them. But we need to destroy everything else. Ooh, another Ith rune. I don't believe I have anything with an Ith, and that would be my third one. Um, get over here and die. Uh, no, I don't have anything with Ith, so... I should feel free to use those. Now, the evil urns, like I said, they work differently. No, I don't want the demon high gloves. They work differently because not only do you get stuff out of it, it also spawns enemies. Some of the time, apparently. I swore it was every time. Maybe it's like 75% of the time or so. Uh, but be on the lookout. Uh, clear the area before you use an evil urn because sometimes it will spawn an enemy. A group of enemies with a special in it. So let's head into the Crystalline Passage. Finally! Now this is going to be another giant place. And we have snow drifters in here. These are uh, upgraded yetis, I believe. Oh, great. Ma mana burn. Just what I wanted to see. When I'm trying to use Blessed Hammer, don't use mana burn on me. Uh, heavy boots. Uh, I'm going to have to go back to town then. Let me try to clear up some room. Uh got to got to go to town more often than I wanted to but that's okay uh because we are still getting through the game this Afternoon. is this is the largest uh part of the game by a mile i've said that more times than i need to though uh yeah we are done with that wow cost more to repair than i sold that's that hasn't happened in a while but i still have more to sell i guess that tells me that i need to start making room and yeah, those were all worthwhile. 3,000. Nice. So, Mala, please give me my MP back. Wow. Thank you. Uh, we still are headed towards the Crystalline Passage to complete her quest, which is the next thing. Are you kidding me? Uh, okay, so three Ith runes. Since I'm not going to be using these for anything, but you could. I mean, it's it's definitely a possibility. I'm just not using them for mine. Um, I'm leveling those up into a Tal rune, which gives us three Tal runes. Unfortunately, I do want to keep the Tal runes, just in case, I believe. Just in case. There are a couple things that I want to get with the Tal rune, uh, but I don't know if we're going to come across it. And then the Dol rune can go in there. Uh, Dol is, yeah, really good. I, I, I'm amazed that I even got one, to be honest with you. Then uh, you guys can sure like that. Okay. Uh oh yeah, need to clear room. Let's get rid of all those super healing potions. I am not using those at all. They only sell for two hundred and fifty though. That means it's just not that great. Which is why I get upset when anything else sells for that little. But. That is all we need to do. Let us head back into the Crystalline Passage. It's going to be the first ice cavern that we come across. There are there are going to be more. And they are quite lengthy, to be honest with you. Uh, let's grab the heavy boots. These are huge. 
Um, there's no way I'm going to be able to, to be sure that I get every single nook and cranny of this place. I'm just going to pick a, a general direction and head in it. That general direction is, for me right now, southeast. That is the way that I want to go. So let's keep that bearing in mind, and hopefully I either find a path down, or more preferably, the waypoint. Because the waypoints are where I have to end sessions. And here we go, upgraded... Oh, we get frozen creepers. Haven't gone over the creepers before. They automatically freeze you with one of their attacks. It's not a fun attack. Yeah. Okay. Uh, there we go, moon lords. These guys suck. <laughs> Alright, switch. And then start attacking with that. And drop anything. Nothing over here. So let's start heading northeast. Try to stay in the easterly direction. If I can. That instantly frees you, which is why I want the half freeze duration. These guys. And they they stay around for quite a bit. It's not like they only appear once. Catch it? Sure. Uh, uh, let's move on then. We need to head this way to resist cold shrine. How lucky of me to get. What weapon am I on? This one. Let's go for this one. Go! Blessed hammer. Damn it. Damn it, Al Hazir. Get over here and help me take on the frozen creepers. Switch. There we go. There we go. Okay. Let's try to keep going the easterly direction. Yeah, I didn't do that well. Like I said, that, that that's my general strategy for this place because, I mean, it is a giant maze at the end of the day. Um, there, uh, there's just fire as well. Uh, you can technically go through all of it. There's not very many dead ends, but it just keeps going in what seems to be all directions. Ooh, another Eth rune. Um, so I just try to pick a direction and then fill it out. Um, after I've found something, some kind of marker of some sort. Chainmail! I uh, don't really care about that, actually. Don't I have? Yeah, I have Talath already. I'm not going to have the next one yet, so no need to check that just yet. And uh, the breastplate, I believe, is better than the chainmail anyway. And I have found the waypoint, which means that we're going back to town now that we have cleared the giant fucking plateau. Oh my god, that thing was huge. Stay a while. Uh, we have completed another quest. We got to the Crystalline Passage. Can I help you? We are done here. Let me just repair that. Nothing in there. Let me take a look um, with... Eth rune. Nope, I've only got two of those. So that means I'll take you with me. Why not? That means that we are done. That is going to do it for these parts of Let's Play Diablo 2. I've been Bala Scuba. I've been joined, as always, by my paladin and Al Hazir. When we come back, we will continue taking on the Crystalline Passage. Looking for the Frozen River, apparently. Hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.